This conference will now be recorded. Okay, so today we are in a plan to go for your project review. Okay, so even two weeks ago, we planned one, but you people are not ready by that time. So as I was saying from past two weeks, you should complete first two screens of project number one. Now you are supposed to share your screen. Okay, so start Chesara. Started right. Who wanted to proceed now? Anyone is ready with your project now? So we can see okay. You got the access to it. Okay. Yeah. So I think you also started with healthcare project only. Both I did uh, first and second. Let's go with insurance only. So insurance. go with insurance. City claims, yeah. This one like this. It is looking a bit colorful. So there is an image, and below is that a video or an image? The second one. This one is video. Video. Yeah. Then uh, automatic and uh, auto uh, loop loop play like mute unmute chase the buttons like on the bottom. Okay. It is. Like, is it currently playing? I cannot see it like frames moving out. Okay. It's is playing. Like for me. It's playing. Okay. okay. So Rajesh, this is what I'm playing. I'm telling you. So. Above first name, there must be one heading like personal details. For the dynamic layout, you can add one heading and you can add one image also. And you should make it like collapsible. Okay, you can just add one small arrow. And how did you apply this color background, Shaker? This I uh, applied from the container uh, settings. Actually, I did not cover this style part. So, how did you uh, how did you do it? And, uh, so if you just double click on dynamic layout, you'll see something called containers. So then you can use different different container. So container is nothing but some kind of space defined styles. But this is also Okay. So at this moment, I'm not expect that styling part from others. Others don't. Know. So this token that where did you apply? That's fine. That's fine. I'll not talk. I'll not look into styles for now, since I haven't covered that. So, first and and last, everything you made as mandatory. And whatever I suggested earlier, like uh, uh, making pan card, mother card mandatory yeah. on conditional basis. And first name when the first name last name is available, then only pan and, and other should make, be available. Then only make this as like. Uh, mandate, sorry, uh, editable, right? I don't it's editable. And make this address as conditional based mandatory. So if it's like minor kind of candidate is minor, then make it as mandatory. Else, make it as not mandatory. But this address should be written visible. Okay, no? Yeah. Okay. And whatever like gender with radio buttons, this is we call it as segmented. Anyway, and you start typing something in email. You start and start typing like one, two, three. This one, two, three. Tabos. Are you getting error message? No, I'm not no. getting error message because. If uh, uh, document like table is there, some a uh, properties this kono data type em this kala ni. Then exact this kono no email ki text input tundi so same this kono an email map share in that control type. Hmm. Email suppose if I'm business analyst, so I'll share you the document and in the document my expectation is it should be looking like in text input and a it should be editable and that meaning there should not be pick list there. So text input that as per or data type, it should not be text or it should not be mobile or it should not be phone and card. 
as a business analyst i'll say it as text meaning user should be in a position to type whatever the text he wanted but as a pega developer you should consider its data type as email only and the meta ah as like a non technical guy i'm giving you requirements ka but you should think about it. a data type actually gan in text input an petti map ches adi email change that to email change that to email. the same with the mobile also okay, okay. Yeah, and you just implement these kind of basic validations that is like first name length should be four characters and maximum up to 16 okay and next to what you'll do is uh, next what you'll do is i wanted to enter uh, i wanted to show age as like very small text box as of now Yes, you can see it occupying maybe twenty-five percentage of its space. Am I correct? Twenty-five, no? Okay. Keep that, hmm, keep that space as twenty-five only. It should occupy twenty-five only, but it should be displayed like very small text box. How to reduce one text field's width is what you have to take care. You double yeah. click on that, and if you go to presentation, there will be something called custom width. so try to yeah. increase or reduce from there okay ee aadhar and pan card alane chestam sir endukante equal vastu kada so ee rendu reduce chest chest okay fine fine just click on upload sir we upload my background upload me them layer just empty button just button button color change chestam solid okay what about like i symbol just mouse over or click on it this is also not expected from others in the chailer kabatti so i'll expect it like one blue color image to be displayed and it should be showing in one proper line okay so whatever like ui so far we completed it should be done and how did you achieve this like uh, uh, cpu image occupying up to 20 percentage only idu nenu 30 70 template this correct correct Okay, so first you are supposed to create one main section, yeah. and in that section it will show like one column template, right? So yeah. you are supposed to change that to maybe thirty seventy, whatever the closest to your requirement. And in left side thirty, you have to create one more subsection and just put one below another. Okay, so this is like so this is the like two the column thirty seven. left side you are including one more section so which shows one below another right side you'll be taking one more section where you need to put in one below another and you required maybe like a four in one row get a one more sub section whatever this, this is complete one sub section age and date of birth and this mm-hmm. is one sub section other number this is one sub section correct 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 okay and others you try to implement with the layouts only if you are not comfortable don't get scared by just Uh, working with the templates okay so try to go with layouts only so try to get your outputs so that is your first target and even you did not apply the checkbox at the last yeah actually a checkbox mere than terms and conditions ankoledu adi pettindi mere than chandra trainings ane ila pettar anukona adu confuse led actually idi add chestu okay so if you are supposed to add terms and conditions at the last in what section you will include in this section in this uh, 30% section no 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 you have to include in the main one if you are including that in first sub section it will occupy 30% only right yeah i want it to display entire screen okay so you have to include this in your main section just look at the requirement once then yeah. you'll come to where to include it okay so this is this is much uh, good whatever you have done so far this is better in terms of colors validations images so your part is looking exact same equation and next up you may have to be ready with validations like that is covered by the plan yes. i will quickly show this uh, first screen of healthcare as well so in insurance you completed only first screen right what about second did you not start? actually uh yeah. that's the add button me the add page oh, sorry the only screen of page hmm okay okay so me the show me that okay so he included one image of all hospitals and then logged in as and how did yeah. you implement that logged in time last logged in time 
క్రియేట్ డేట్ టైం ప్రాపర్టీ మ్యాప్ చేస్తాం కానీ లాగిన్ యాప్స్ కి ఏ ప్రాపర్టీ యాడ్ చేస్తే కానీ ఏ ప్రాపర్టీ ఓకే ఆపరేటర్ ఐడి కదా ఓకే ఐ విల్ ఎక్స్ప్లెయిన్ దిస్ లేటర్ సో ఐ బికాజ్ ఇఫ్ ఐ సే ఇట్ హస్ పీవై యూజర్ ఐడెంటిఫైయర్ సో పీపుల్ మైట్ నాట్ అండర్స్టాండ్ ఓకే సో యు కెన్ రీచ్ మీ పర్సనలీ సో సిన్స్ యు ఆర్ గోయింగ్ లిటిల్ అడ్వాన్స్డ్ యు కెన్ రీచ్ మీ పర్సనలీ హెల్ప్ అండ్ ఇది మ్యాప్ ఇంక్లూడ్ చేసి యాక్చువల్లీ యూట్యూబ్ లో ఏపీ కి ఉంటే ఆ ఐపీ కి యాడ్ చేస్తాం బట్ బట్ ఏపీ కి ఆర్ నాట్ వర్కింగ్ ఓకే దిస్ డేస్ ఏపీ దిస్ ఆర్ లైక్ చార్జబుల్ యు మే హావ్ టు మేక్ పేమెంట్ ఫర్ దట్ సో ఇట్ ఇస్ నాట్ కంప్లీట్లీ కస్టమైజబుల్ బట్ దట్స్ వైన్ యు ట్రైట్ ఫస్ట్ నేమ్ ఫ్యామిలీ ఇది యాక్చువల్లీ ఇమేజ్ చేస్తా ఇది నేను లేపు ఇమేజ్ కాదా ఇస్ దట్ నాట్ ఇట్స్ నాట్ ఇమేజ్ <laughs> so did you implemented with paragraph rule then ah uh, paragraph rule lo source mode use chesi design chesi yeah, i included an image actually why because if you click on that image if there might be some action that should be possible but if you are including it as a paragraph rule paragraph rule will not have action suppose on click of that apollo hospitals i wanted to open apollo hospitals website and you cannot do it because you implement it as a paragraph paragraph will not have action right double click says so you not see actions for that other than that understood right understood change and that to yeah i will change sir idi ikkada document lo logged in as anedi ee right side ku vachindi ettu kuda right side ku vachi ikkada value vastundi అది ఎలా సో ఫర్ దట్ వాట్ యూ డూ ఈస్ యూ హ్ టు గో ఫర్ ఇన్ లైన్ లేబుల్స్ లెఫ్ట్ ఓకే సో వాట్ ఎవర్ ద సెక్షన్ యూ క్రియేటెడ్ అండ్ యూ మేడ్ ఇట్ లైక్ టూ బై టూ అంతే కదా పౌండ్స్ సో ఇన్స్టెడ్ ఆఫ్ టూ బై టూ యూ విల్ సీ ఏ డైనమిక్ లేఅవుట్ విత్ సంథింగ్ కాల్డ్ ఇన్ లైన్ లేబుల్స్ లెఫ్ట్ ఓకే సో ఇఫ్ యూ టేక్ దట్ డైనమిక్ లేఅవుట్ వాట్ ఎవర్ యూ డ్రాప్ ఇన్ సైడ్ all the controls will show its label to the left and control to the right side idu ila template lo design is ante me cheptu template what are so actually we are having one dynamic layout for that but if you want to implement with one new uh, implement with templates em cheyalante you have to create new template now suppose you open the double two column open that two column click on the two column. so dynamic layout stacked region and the 1.1 double click on 1.1 1.1 okay and other uh, other class for other select check and click on down arrow you will see like inline labels left okay you have to select that so now whatever you drop inside a it should show left and right avuna yeah. kada so in this way you have to do. but you are not supposed to modify template right you have to create new template in this case yeah. you have to create new template you have to take one uh, new dynamic layout and then you have to make it like labels in this scenario creating a new template is accepted because there is no overlap for you the man now yeah then అండ్ వన్ మోర్ థింగ్ సార్ ఇప్పుడు మనము ఈ టైటిల్ ఇది బోల్డ్ చేస్తున్నాము సార్ ఇలా ప్రతి ప్రాపర్టీ చేయకుండా నేను దీంట్లో చెప్తున్న ప్రతిదీ ఇంకా డిఫాల్ట్ గా వచ్చడానికి ఏమన్నా ఆప్షన్ ఇప్పుడు నేను టైటిల్ అనే ప్రాపర్టీకి ఇది ఓపెన్ చేసి నేను బోల్డ్ చేస్తాను డిఫాల్ట్ బోల్డ్ ఉండదు సార్ సో నేను దాన్ని బోల్డ్ మార్చుకున్నాను so for one text box whatever the label you see like label uh, title so that by, that will be by default bold eh kada kada by default bold ga sir ikkada nenu heading 2 and marchin tarata bold vachindi okay default heading 1 undi okay okay fine fine so you wanted to still make little bolder for that you are changing it to heading 2 or 3 or 4 okay so okay. if you want like same kind of bold style applicable for every text box and then anything 
అంటే ఈ అప్లికేషన్ లో నేను ఇంకా ఎక్కడి నుంచి ఏ టెక్స్ట్ ఇన్పుట్ కొత్తది క్రియేట్ చేసిన టెక్స్ట్ ప్రాపర్టీ కానీ ఏదైనా ప్రాపర్టీ దాన్ని లేబుల్ వచ్చేటప్పటికి ఇంకా డిఫాల్ట్ హెడ్డింగ్ టూ రావాలి సో వాట్ యుల్ డూ ఇస్ క్లిక్ ఆన్ క్యాన్సిల్ ఫర్ నా క్లిక్ ఆన్ క్యాన్సిల్ టేక్ వన్ న్యూ టెక్స్ట్ ఇన్పుట్ ఈ రీజియన్ కి క్లిక్ ఆన్ ప్లేస్ అండ్ టేక్ వన్ టెక్స్ట్ ఇన్పుట్ double click on that just open go to presentation okay go to presentation okay so by default you are seeing label format as standard am i correct yeah okay. so i take 100 100 new text boxes maybe 1000 new text boxes everywhere i'll see it as standard only so what is your problem ante everywhere you have to change that to heading 1 or heading 1 heading 1 ante kada instead of that what you will do is you will open skin rule so in skin rule you will see this standard as one option right yes yeah. or no yeah. so for standard i'll see some bold color right some bold size edu untundi for standard itself if you are increasing size to from something like 20 pixel what happens so wherever i use the standard wherever i use standard everywhere my new style will be applicable correct ana correct okay so by default for every text box format is standard only so standard meaning with some kind of style whatever the color it might be or size it might be now if i open skin rule and check for standard i can see what are the styles it is defined with i can see what are the styles it is defined for heading 1 heading 2 heading 3 so for standard itself if i make change everywhere it will be applicable right i need not again personally take care of everything got it yeah got it. so standard ki define chestunna styles and changes ki ekkadaina standard on a fresh shot ad apply ante kada mari by default you are seeing it as standard applicable everywhere if you can make that root point affected everywhere it should be affected got it okay let's just open that output i think this is also perfectly done so far just open your output ones scroll down okay so okay so this is what i'll expect for now after you selecting some radio buttons you should implement something like data copying or something like repeating part that you cannot do it today itself so you may have to wait for uh, next two to three weeks okay that's that's great that's great okay Yeah, you got to close your door and stop. So next, who wanted to proceed? Anyone wanted to go? Yeah, I will do, sir.